Well, Patrick, did you think this was possible back when we were doing that Overage preview story in August? Yeah, obviously uh, a lot of things can change, and obviously we proved that with the character we have in that room. Uh, we were able to just uh, turn a corner and just uh, believe in ourselves, and uh, yeah, obviously it's an uh, incredible feeling to be where we are today. Where did that come from down 5-2 tonight? You know, just kind of regroup and reset, realize you had 10 minutes to go, and where did that come from? Yeah, I think uh, I've said it for uh, the whole second half of the year. The character in that room is unbelievable. I've never been uh, around him a team that's like that. I think uh, we just need a little fire to be sparked under us, and we were able to get that, and we uh, came out and we were able to capitalize. Kevin kind of mentioned it, but for you and Matt and him, you know, from six years ago now, from your draft, it's been your whole time with this organization, now kind of cap it off with this, with one more to go, obviously. But uh, what does that mean, if you've had a chance to think about it in 10 minutes? Oh, man, yeah, obviously uh, a lot of emotions in the last 10 minutes. Uh, I almost can't put it into words. This organization's obviously been... Uh, Something real special. It's, uh, I can't even, like I said, put it into words how uh, great they've all been to uh, me personally my uh, six years here and obviously those other two guys and everyone else on this team. They're uh, uh, first class organization. I can't even, I don't even know, almost speechless. You guys were buzzing there after you tied it last five, ten, how many minutes were left. Uh, what was the mood of the room like, going into overtime after that? Yeah, I think uh, we struggled with uh, second periods and that almost felt like that, obviously, going out and having that second period. Uh, switch with the goalie so I think we wanted to make sure we could carry that over into uh, the overtime I think we were we pressed hard and we left when we were at our best. Those two goals you scored again tonight uh, you talked there about being challenged to feel you've risen up to that? Uh, yeah that game obviously uh, two games ago I think I've uh, maybe slipped back a little bit I don't think uh, tonight obviously I don't think I played up to my uh, expectations throughout uh, after the first period but I think that's something that I can regroup on and something I can uh, focus on in this next round. And you guys all season all playoffs have always had the pushback or the answer goals seems like whenever you guys fall behind you, you know, usually it's just one day but when you guys fight on threes there's still some confidence on the bench there's only nine minutes left or whatever. Yeah I think it's important not to get too high not too low keep our uh, emotions in check and uh, yeah I don't know I think uh, just the best word to describe is the character and uh, the push that we were able to have like you mentioned. What's the bus ride home going to be like? It's going to be a fun one. Obviously, we're going to enjoy it now. Uh, yeah, <laughs> it's going to be a, a good ride home. Obviously, enjoy it for now. And obviously, we know we got some work coming ahead of us. Well. Thanks, Pat.